Greetings everyone. Today, we will delve into the utilization of Data Visa Access Proxy to safeguard corporate applications without the need for a VPN. This is made possible through the activation of single sign-on, multi-factor authentication, and granular access control. As a clientless zero-trust network access solution, Data Visa Access Proxy eliminates the need for managed device installations, resulting in a more streamlined user experience. In this demonstration, we will be employing Azure Active Directory as our preferred identity provider. We will guide you through the necessary steps to begin, such as creating a new deployment and application, configuring an Azure AD Identity Provider, IDP, and much more. By the conclusion of this demonstration, you will appreciate the simplicity of securing internal or external applications using Data Visa Access Proxy without relying on a VPN. Let's dive in. Firstly, let's create a new deployment called Data Visa Demo and a new application called Corporate App. Remember to note the public domain as the entry point for the user to type into their browser, and the upstream address as the internal address of the protected application, and the listen port number as the port on which the Data Visa Access Proxy will listen. Next, we need to configure a new Azure AD IDP and name it Azure AD use the one-click automatic generator to set up all Azure AD settings for us. Once you complete the setup, you will see a green message box indicating that your deployment has been successfully created. Copy the provisioning keys or the YAML file as you will need them later. If you are using SSL on the public domain and don't have a reverse proxy or load balancer to handle SSL traffic, you can enable SSL and let the Data Visa Access Proxy handle it. Now, switch back to the terminal, create a YAML file, and paste the content you copied from the previous step. Use the docker compose up d command to spin up the Data Visa Access Proxy. With this, we have finished the configuration part. Now, open a new browser and navigate to jfrog.example.com. You will see an SSO login button. Click the button, and you will be automatically redirected to the target IDP login page. Here, Azure AD prompts the user to enter their ID credentials. Once the user has successfully authenticated using MFA, the user will be redirected to the application. With this setup, we have a zero trust end-to-end -end protection taking place between the user and the application, ensuring secure access. That concludes our demonstration of how DataWise Access Proxy can easily and securely protect corporate applications. Thank you for watching.